So this video is going to be talking about how to one cycle Egg Emperor with Team Rose, um, the method that you use to do it, and some of the nuances and things that can go wrong. So first of all, first thing to understand is that we're going to want to get a double rocket excel right at the start of the fight in order to get behind him as quickly as possible. That's going to set up the one cycle for us. So in order to do that, we need to know exactly when to start holding up. And it's actually going to be kind of counterintuitive since we have this opening cutscene and we want to hold up as we gain control, kind of, which happens to be like sort of part of the cutscene, if you can see. I start holding up like right here. So you can see it's like still kind of the cutscene, the camera's yet to move back. But if I hold up here, it's going to set it up so that big is in position for this double rocket excel. Sometimes when you go for this, you're gonna notice that big is not where he's supposed to be, and that just means that you weren't holding up at the right time. So yeah, you're gonna hold up. As you gain control, you're gonna hold B for a little bit to start up the rocket excel. When you notice that your characters are lined up to do it, you can uh, press B twice to get it. And you're gonna want Amy to have this like yellow blue aura around her um so there there are some times when you will do the double rocket excel and it looks like this which is good there are other times where you'll go for it and she doesn't have this aura around here for like very long and that's not going to work i think that's because you're just not like charging it for long enough if that happens so if that happens and you don't get this like really long roll animation just try to focus on holding B for like just a split second longer. So the first thing we have to do, once we get this good rocket excel that we want, we want to get past this first blade beam attack. We're just ever so slightly going to go around it to the right side. And if you actually pay attention to my control stick after I get this um, rocket excel, you're going to notice I do this very, very subtle tap upright. So just watch my control stick here. Just like very, very subtle. And if you notice what it does is it's going to avoid it. It barely even looks like she moved around it, but it was just enough to. It's going to avoid this blade beam attack. If you were to just hold straight up the whole time, you'd run right into it and get hit. But that ever so slight tap to the right is going to avoid it. So... Just get used to doing that once you initiated the rocket excel. And it also sets it up so that we don't hit his foot here, which is another common problem. And that's really good because as you can see, cream is also lined up here perfectly. So once we get out of this double rocket excel, by the way, after you do the subtle tap, just go right back to holding straight up. Uh, once you are actionable again, you're literally just going to press and release B when you're like underneath him, it's gonna get you a single rocket excel with cream, which is 100% always going to make it past him and get the flight power up you need, so it's perfect. And that's like the fastest way of getting around him. So we're set up for the one cycle here, which is good. Um, the next part here, you wanna make sure that you hit this ramp as big. Uh, you wanna try to aim for the relative like middle of it. If you're too far to the right, Big himself is going to go through the speed ring up here, which you don't want. You only want Cream to go through it like that. So Cream's going to get that balloon for our second flight power up, which is perfect. Um, if you did everything fast enough, which if you've followed along up until this point, you should have. Uh, Egg Emperor is going to catch up to you at around like the 14 second mark or so. He's going to like come up from behind you in order to avoid taking knockback from him hitting you, what you're gonna do is you're gonna get into flight formation here and hold literally straight left against this wall here. So if you watch, he's gonna come up from behind me. He's gonna hit me, but he's not going to knock my characters down, which is what you want. And if you just hold straight left against that wall, that's how you avoid that. And then this last part, we want both Amy and Big to latch onto him for this one cycle to work. Usually Big gets it every time. Amy, getting Amy to latch onto him is, it feels like 
slightly RNG based. I'll be honest. But as you notice, I can kind of like flick the controller towards him. If I notice Amy's like veering off to the left here, I can kind of flick it right and try to get her to like latch onto him like that. So using the control stick can help. It's not going to be a 100% perfect solution every time. But just know that you do have some sort of influence over where she goes. A lot of the time she's just going to like fly off to the side and you're going to have to just set up for the two cycle, which is still a 30 second fight. It's not bad, but that is 10 seconds. A lot of the time Amy might aim for like these robots down here. And like I said, you can kind of like influence her to go back if you can. Um, actually, at the end of this fight, what ends up happening is Big leaves early and then Amy starts targeting his shield. And you'll notice he has a little bit of HP left, so in order to get Amy to go back to him, I kind of just do a couple flicks to the left. And that brings her back over there for just that split second to finish him off. So when you're going for the double hit with both characters, just know that you have a little bit of influence, but not complete control over it. But the important part is everything up until that last part. So I'm going to play it one more time and hopefully you can get a good idea of uh, what you're supposed to do. Yep, and that's how you beat Emperor in... Technically, you can do it in about 18 or 19 seconds if it's super clean, but if you get that strat down, it should be under 22 seconds every time. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.